interviewing Rhonda for Dillard, and this is my friend helping me interview Rhonda. Hi, I'm Kiki, and I'm helping Emmy interview my mom. And I'm Rhonda Liebig from Rhonda Liebig Health Coach, and I have these girls interviewing me about yoga and what I'm doing with the kids at the school, so I'm excited to hear what they have to ask me. So the first question is, Rhonda, how did you get into what you do? I started at a very young age. I was about four, I was about 14 years old when I really discovered working out, and that was like really important to me because I didn't feel so happy. That's kind of when your hormones all kick in, and I was feeling kind of sad at that time, just because. And so I started working out and felt really, really good. And so by the time I was 19, I was working out all the time, but in a very structured way. So I was already in the gym. And a woman asked me to teach at her gym because I was wild and crazy while I was teaching, but I was an extremely shy girl. I barely talked to anybody, anybody at all. But when I was in the studio, in their studio, I was hooting and having a good time. So I always knew this was for me. So I got started that way. And then seeing people make changes has been a very big transformational, eye-opening thing that this is where I need to be. So the second question, Rhonda, is um, what does yoga do for your body? Good question. Actually, that's a big one, but let's go down to the basics of what happens. You know, yoga helps you get focused and be able to start listening to your body. And I find that a lot of people that are walking around that they haven't really felt like how their body feels. And then when they get a little ache, they sometimes miss it because they're not really in tune with their body. What yoga does is it helps you just really get in tune, strengthen from the inside out because your mind is focused on different parts of your body as you're doing different moves. Some people think that yoga is boring. So the biggest challenge that I usually have for people is to stay focused and start listening to their body and then start moving and it becomes easier to start getting attached with being aware of what you're doing. So the, did I answer your question, ladies? Yes. I did? Okay. I was going off there a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> so the last question is, what benefits do children get out of it? You know what? That is actually a really good question because I wasn't aware of this at first. When I first started doing <laughs> yoga with kids, I was thinking it was not going to be very... Um, I don't, I don't know, like if I wasn't going to be able to get to kids when I did this because I didn't understand how much stress the kids carry too. And so with the, what I've seen in the yoga that I've been doing every year, it's usually with Jacob and Kirsten's classes that I get involved in, that I find that the students start focusing in as soon as they come into the room, when I come in the room, they're, most of them, I'd say 99% of the group is quiet focused and ready to go. So it helps them learn how to focus and get control over what they're doing. Because I, I think sometimes when we're young, we don't realize how much more control we have over our body if we just start listening. So I help them listen to their body, help them learn that when they're stressed out, when the brother or sister's giving them a bad time, that they know how to bring in the calm so they're not like, oh, my brother, which I hear all the time. And, and then, so that's a transformation. And I see if their bodies become strong in a different way. And that their mind, they, they remember the moves so quick. And so we're even right now in the classes I'm doing right now, I have leaders that are up there and I'm not even working with, out with them at all. I'm just telling them what to do. So they love I'm introducing them as being a leadership too. So it's really fun. Well, that was our last question. Thank you, Rhonda, for being with us today. You're welcome. Thank you for asking me all those questions. You're welcome. <laughs>